the once a month. And we're now just having a breakfast. Uh, French breakfast with a croissant and a coffee. Okay. I have a croissant and a mocha for breakfast today. So we now have taken the underground to get to Notre Dame. And you can see it over here. I'm not sure if it's focusing. It's I see Notre Dame. Like a hotel over there. And not like a better weather day. Still a little bit cold, but not as bad as yesterday. And it's sunny. Blue sky. It's still by Notre Dame. Still buy that Notre Dame. <laughs> um, I really wish I had like some kind of souvenirs from like a hunchback of Notre Dame. I feel like that's missing. Paris, get on that. <laughs> Them and I think it's really beautiful like even though I'm not religious myself I think it's, it's just like a part of history and I think it's really, yeah. I don't know how to explain it I just think it's beautiful to see and it's, I think it's always important to remember that no matter like what religion you believe in or not believe in you always have to, res always have to respect each other so if you go into a church or into a mosque all this respect you also have yeah, I just felt like sharing that and I think it's, yeah, it's really cool to see. Like this is something I've seen, seen on TV or in movies and I finally get to see it in real life. So that's so cool. <laughs> it's like a backside of that you then. Small little garden.
got some Malala bread. I'll just make it in there. And some Nutella. So we're now walking from Notre Dame to the Louvre. Uh, probably not saying that correctly, but yeah, it sounds like cute with like a river. Um, it's probably close. Is this river called something? Oh, it's not it. I don't know. Huh? Yeah. It's so cute. There's so many letters, it's so nice to walk outside. It's very nice today. So we're now by Montmartre. And look at all those stairs in there. Can't wait. It's pretty pretty here though. A steep hill. We're walking up there. So these stairs may not look that bad on the hill. That's a lot of stairs. <laughs> I like the environment here, it's like really like small streets and stuff like that. But let's do this. So one, two. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, that's a 
Most recommend going here. They are apparently shooting a movie right over there. Sunny, so that's why we, that's why we want to go back. Also, the blue sky. <laughs> bye bye, Eiffel Tower. Bye bye. You know, heading back to London. We came back from Paris yesterday, but all we did was basically just go to eat and then go to bed because we we're really tired. Um, so today we're just gonna go, I think, to Primark, Boots, Topshop, and just basically go through things there. We saw things, but not 100% sure if we want to get or not. So we're gonna go back there before our plane leave. Plane leaves this evening. Mine leaves around like a quarter seven or something, and hers leaves at nine. Quarter to nine, yeah. So we're just getting ready, gonna go eat and then go shopping a little bit, and then yeah. In a new hotel room, it's about the same, it's a little bit like a little bit older, I think, than the one we had last time. We stay in the same hotel as we did because then we could like leave our luggage and stuff like that. So we got the Mexican restaurant called and we got the Mexican version called Chiquito and we just got our starter <laughs> and it's uh, 
garlic bread. It looks really good. Oh, come on. Look at that. This is so not good. She has some um, um, pet bread. And I have a classical chili thing that's mm. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. It's like 6 p.m. <laughs> anyway, uh, I arrived back from London last night. I ended up not really vlogging when I got back just because I was really stressed and really tired because I almost <laughs> lost my flight. Um, sorry. It's getting, my camera is not feeling too well, so it's really blurry sometimes. So sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> anyway, I almost lost my flight. Um, I was literally on the minute. Because uh, Gatwick Express was delayed by like half an hour and I was like, oh my, my, my gate is like closing in five minutes. I ran up to get my luggage, but when I got there, the, on like just on the minute I was there, the, there was something wrong with the, check, the self check-in. So I had to go to the other check-in, but by that time it was over, what was it? 6 p.m. where I had to be there and <laughs> the lady was like oh yeah sorry I can get you in but I can't get your luggage I was like I was here all the minute and the Gatwick Express was delayed by half an hour can you please do something so she got her man manager I think and she fixed it thank you so much by the way <laughs> I think it wasn't just me I think it was uh, some people going to Helsinki and other people going to Oslo as well had the same problem as me because of the delay I need to stop doing this <laughs> because of the delay with the express. But I made it with like no minutes to spare and I was a lot of running and slightly stressed because of that and I was also really tired because I'm do I have my holding over? Um yeah. So I didn't really end up vlogging and I got I didn't really do anything, I just <laughs> sat on a plane, I vlogged a little bit from there. Uh, I sat on the plane and then took a train back to Oslo basically. <laughs> And uh, yes, I had an amazing trip, uh, absolutely recommend it if you have the possibility to like go to Paris if you're in London just for like a couple of days, it's an absolutely amazing, I had such a good time, it was my first time in Paris, I've been to London, this is my fourth time in London, this is my really first time in Paris and I absolutely loved the city, I was like oh. I want to go back, so I really want to go back there one time and stay for like a longer amount of time than just two, two days. <laughs> but yes, uh, absolutely amazing. And by the way, this is going to sound really random, but when I was taking a picture by the um, Paris wheel, it's called the one in London, the big wheel, I f felt kind of rude towards one of the other tourists there that asked me if if they could ask if I could take a picture for them uh, and I was like no I'm taking my own picture but I was really tired and cold <laughs> and hungry so if you're watching this probably not I'm really sorry next time if I randomly see you again I will definitely take a picture for you guys I will take the best picture you've ever seen uh, <laughs> I, I don't know why I felt like I just wanted to say, say sorry for that because I'm not usually like it but I was in the middle of taking a, a picture myself, so uh, <laughs> um, you might be like, why are you telling us this? But I was like, I felt really bad. Like, why didn't I just take the picture? It would, it would take me two seconds to just take the camera, take a picture of them, and then take my own picture just straight after. Like, why <laughs> did I have to be so rude? <laughs> well, I wasn't really rude. I was more like, can you please wait for two seconds? Uh, but I ended up taking them. A little bit more time because I have this thing I do. I take a picture with my uh, leg up in front of like this different kind of monuments and places. So it takes a bit more time than a couple of seconds that, that I thought it was gonna take. So that was a long rant. I just want to say sorry for that. You're probably not watching this, um, but yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, anywho, I just wanted to end this. End this little daily day vlog um, 
And I kind of want to get back into it because I thought it was a lot of fun and I actually missed it. So yeah, and this was a long rant. <laughs> a long um, necessary rant about absolutely nothing. Anyway, um, yes, so that's about it. I am now back. I've been to work again. So I don't really have a life, but I want to try to get back into like daily vlogging again and uh, maybe go around Oslo and show off different things that like, you can go and see here because I don't really feel, I haven't really done a lot myself here in Oslo because I'm basically, I'm working all the time, but yeah, I kind of want to go back to that. I'm saying yes so many times right now. I am tired, sorry, I arrived la late last night and I've been to work. So I'm going to end this now. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so I just felt like explaining that the fact that I wasn't late for the flight, but the check-in. <laughs> you know, you have to be there 45 minutes before departure. That was, a, that was what I was late for, not the plane. The plane didn't have to wait for me. It was the check-in. 